Hello everyone, thank you for stumbling on my video. My name is Ed Diaz and I'm here to share a quick unboxing, overview, and install of Western Digital's Blue SN550 solid state drive. This one terabyte model can be found on Amazon for $139.99. Like most of you, I'm currently quarantined and decided to use this time to do some research on PC builds. This led me to the decision to go with an NVMe SSD chose to go with this particular model for the amount of space and my trust in Western Digital's products. The manufacturer's site claims to reach read speeds of 2,400 megabytes per second and write speeds of 1,950 megabytes per second. An important thing to note, this product does not include the screws to mount your solid state drive. You'll have to look through your motherboard's package for the right screws. Once you have the right screws, installation can be a little nerve wracking, but it's actually very easy. I'll be installing my solid state drive on an ASUS Prime X570-P motherboard. I tightened the first screw by hand, making sure that it was nice and snug and not over tightened. Inserting the solid state drive into your motherboard's M.2 socket can feel like it's going to snap, but don't worry, it'll slip into place. Looking back, I should have held it closer to the socket when installing it. I think that would have given me more support. Finish up by tightening the final screw into place. Again, just snug enough. Do not over tighten. This is going to be my first PC build, and this is the first time I've ever tried to do any kind of installation like this. Thanks for watching. Hope you come back and check out the complete build.